This is Tech Life 3.0. Patrick TV. This is Patrick for Patrick TV. Today I'm going to share with you Google Glass. Everybody's talking about it. And wearable technology. Because it will impact you business-wise as an innovator in your career and in life and in fun. Speaking of disruptive technologies, a video was released last week by Google um, sh showing the potential of Google Glass. Uh, blew a lot of people's minds. Okay, Glass, record a video. This is it. We're on in two minutes. Okay, Glass, hang out with the Flying Club. Google Photos of Tiger Heads. Hmm. You ready? You ready? Right there. Okay, Glass, take a picture. This past spring, Google Glass was launched by Google. It's the brainchild of Sergey Brin, one of the founders of Google. It all took place in the sky over the Moscone Center in San Francisco as they launched it in a very experiential way that was in keeping with the smart device, smart headset. As a master innovator and business 3.0 expert, I'm always watching mobile and social and companies that are breaking out, particularly on innovation, their pipeline, and their patent activity. So 18 months ago, I knew that Google Glass was coming, but I was particularly pleased to get an invitation to come pick up the Google Glass at their New York location. Much like Apple would do, the environment was pristine, nicely done, totally choreographed. My Google Glass came in an elegant shopping bag. As I pulled out the box and opened it up, it was like a gift. Vellum cover over the headset. As you open it up, there was just the headset underneath it were all the components, each one designed at a 200% level. Very nicely done. As I exit Google's Explorer headquarters, one last request, wear Google Glass for 48 hours. And you wouldn't believe what happens when people see you with this out in public, on the streets, in mass transit, in bars, restaurants, and with your friends. Everybody talks about it. You touch the side of your headset to get started or you look up at a 30 degree angle and quickly come back down and up comes OK Glass on the screen, on the lens. You then issue the commands, make a video, make a call, translate, search, etc. But it all starts with a head nod. You can also use your finger on the side to move forward or move back to move across different functions, settings, look at videos, look at pictures, it's a beautiful day to go out with Google Glass for a bike ride. Right now, I've just said, okay, Glass, record a video. I've extended it. I could take a picture. I could also ask for directions. If I met someone I needed to translate, I, I could say Google Translate. Google Glass Translate. I'm cruising along. It deposits the video into my Google Plus account. I can also use Google Cards. I can take a look at nearby restaurants, the weather in this city or other cities. I could also post to Facebook and Twitter, so it's got a nice social feed. My assessment, Google did a nice job. A plus for a beta. Yeah, there's some details that need to be worked out. But for the most part, they've done a really nice job. And you can see that the first 10,000 people that are doing the beta and giving feedback that when they come forward with a product in early 2014, they will have, will have tremendous insights that will guide them to take it to a different level. The user experience, nicely done. The linkage through Google, it's fine. They say that iPhone, iPad, 
will be coming. Twitter, Facebook, they've thought that through. But there are other things that you look for that will be deeper and more involved, I suspect, in 2014. This is not just about Google Glass. Here's what I want you to take away. It's an exploding mobile world that creates opportunity for entrepreneurs and innovators. New solutions, new designs, new business models, new ways to make money. So factor it into whatever you're working on. It's not just smartphones. It's now smart devices. And they're connected to social, to the cloud, to different information sources called APIs. It's about technologies other places. Electronic manufacturers, household appliances, the entire home, your car. All these technologies are connecting to mobile and to social and now wearable technology. This is Patrick for Patrick TV. Have a great day and put your glasses on. This is Tech Life 3.0. Patrick TV.